Oh my god. It's a cowan that's staring into my soul. Kalu, what the heck? Why are you screaming like that? This cow mooed at me, and it was very scary. I'm scared of this cow daddy. Is that all? I thought you was being murdered or something with you screaming like that, and why the heck are you scared of that cow? It can't hurt you. That's what it wants you to think. It was staring right into my soul just before it mooed at me. I think it wants to enslave me as revenge for eating its relatives on bread buns. By that I mean burgers. Please don't let it enslave me daddy. Huh. <sighs> Kalu, you are being very stupid right now. The cow isn't going to enslave you. Now come on, it's getting late. Kalu, for the last time, will you go back in your own bed? But I don't want to. What if the cow comes for me in the night? I don't want to sleep alone. How many times do we have to go over this, Kalo? The cow isn't going to enslave you as an act of revenge. You just have a very crazy imagination. But it stared right into my soul. It wants something from me. I know it. It doesn't want anything from you. It's just a stupid cow. Now I'm not going to tell you again. Go back in your own bed or else you'll be grounded. Oh. Can I sleep in here with you guys, just for tonight? I'm still a little freaked out by that cow. If we let you sleep with us, are you going to stop talking about that stupid cow? Yes, because I want to stop talking about it as it's still freaking me out. Alright fine, you can sleep in our bed, but just for tonight. Tomorrow night, you're going back in your own bed, understand? Yes sir, and thank you. I feel so much safer sleeping with you guys. Whatever. Now shut up and go to sleep. Hey dad, I think you just did a silent but deadly fart. Kalu, can I say something to you? What is it daddy? Shut up.